Uh, hey there, um, this is uh, Ruben Horn. I'm one of the tutors for Econ 1320. Uh, a request has been made uh, that I produce an instructional video that tells you how to use CADSTAT 270. Um, the reason why um, it's important is because the latest version of CADSTAT, uh, which is the uh, Excel module that we use for Econ 1320, uh, doesn't have the Durbin Watson uh, test um, functional in it, uh, and the earlier version uh, does, but um, CADSTAT uh, 270 has some compatibility problems with Windows 10. Uh, so we have uh, a workaround for that. Now, Durbin Watson, um, just returning to that subject, is important because uh, Durbin Watson is uh, used to test for autocorrelation in time series, and that's kind of a topic that we'll get up to later in the uh, subject. Uh, but um, CADSTAT obviously, as I'm saying, is a program that uh, that has includes this uh, this um, test and its earlier software, and uh, so therefore we need kind of a workaround to get it working. So he, he, here's the way that you get um, CADSTAT to work. First of all, you actually have to have the software, so you download that from somewhere. Uh, hopefully, it's on Blackboard. Um, if it isn't, it should be somewhere else on the web. Uh, but once you have it, you've got to install it, um, and that that's just a simple. Uh, process of running an application, what have you, then you should wind up with this uh, desktop icon. Um, now, the way that you get it to run, it's a little tricky. You've got to, uh, first of all, uh, click on that icon, and you'll notice that you don't have add ins here, so it's not running at this stage. Um, so you have to go to File, and then you go to Options, and you go to Add ins, and you click on Go. Uh, now you have to uncheck all of these things, uh, Analysis Toolpack, Analysis Toolpack VBA, and CADSTAT 270 um, in add-ins. Then you click on OK. Uh, now you've got this um, new cell here. So so you, you go back to uh, File, and you go to Options again. Uh, and here you have to go to Add-ins again, and click on Go down the bottom here again. And then you basically check Analysis Toolpack, Analysis Toolpack VBA and CADSTAT 270. Uh, so then you click on uh, OK and what will happen will be you'll get this little window here where it says uh, install CAD in as add-in uh, and in this window um, you've got to have that checked. In this window you basically click on update. Uh, now it says CADSTAT uh, 270.xla is now installed. Click on OK. Now here's the really important bit. If you want it to run uh, you have to click on this X. You can't click on exit. So you click on the X um, it won't run immediately, but I found that if you go and you kind of reduce the window and you open it up again, it suddenly appears. So you've got add-ins here, and now CAD stats working. Um, so um, just to illustrate, you have all of these options here now, and in regression and correlation, for this, this part here, for simple and multiple linear regression, you'll be able to run the Durbin-Watson test, which, as I said, is important. Um, so, okay, so that, that's how you get um, CAD stat. 270 working on uh, Windows 10. Um, I hope that helps and hopefully I'll see you all this semester. Um, thanks for listening. Uh, peace out.